going on, everybody? This is Matt Does Fitness, and Mary had a little lamb. The midwife was astounded. Okay, this is a bodybuilding workout, which you very rarely see from me, um, which I completed the other day. Now, the reason um, I did this, or the reason I'm showing this as well, is for a couple of reasons. So first things first, I've just completed my test week. Um, I had a couple of days to kill, and I thought I would do some bodybuilding stuff. So I did a chest and triceps workout. Now, what I thought I'd do is show you this footage, um, and at the same time, have a little chat, and when I say chat, I mean just me talking by myself in a room um, about how my testing went and what I, what I kind of think about it. Um, so as you can see here, I'm doing some heavy chest dumbbell press, which by the way, I can now do in my gym because I have heavier dumbbells. These are 50 kilogram dumbbells, which is, what is that, like 110 pounds, I guess. Um, I did those for a few sets. Um, I then did all kinds of chest and tricep stuff, which you will see as the video unfolds. Now, back to my testing. So, um, presumably you've seen my uh, attempts, uh, which is a very loose description for two of them, the bench and the deadlift one, and my squat PR. If you haven't seen them already, go and watch them now because A, uh, I want you to, and B, because this video will make more sense if you've seen them. So. Starting with the squat, I'm obviously very happy with that. It's a PR, it's a pretty decent PR, and I'm getting well into the 500 pound territory, moving up towards my year target of 600 pounds, which I feel like is definitely on. Um, I reckon I've got more there now. I reckon I had another maybe 10 pounds there, um, but I, I mean, I explained it in the video. After that, I, I messed up my attempts. I was scared, and so I didn't go in heavy enough, and so I wasted... Uh, Attempts and then my CNS was fatigued. By the way, look at that shoulder isolation. Um, even though that's not even a shoulder press, all kinds of contractions, uh, contractions going on there. I'm not talking about the labour kinds. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I went in too light and therefore I missed, uh, I wasted uh, energy and my CNS was fatigued by the time it got to the really big one. But I still got a PR, so I'll take it. Um, following that, my bench press, uh, that was rubbish. There is no other way to describe it. Um, or there is, you could say crap, useless, awful, pathetic, embarrassing, um, shameful, I could go on. But I mean, to be honest, I didn't feel great on the day anyway, so I don't think I would have got it in any setup, but the, the setup itself, the bench, I didn't really get on with it. So I'm going to try and kind of move things around uh, in the gym in terms of my bench press so that I can get a bit more comfortable because it just didn't feel right. Something about it was off um, and it didn't, you know, I just didn't feel comfortable in my setup. So Pretty much as soon as I started warming up, I knew a PR was not going to happen. But I am very stubborn and uh, fairly OCD slash autistic, so I thought I would give it a go anyway. Um, yeah, so that wasn't great. But, I mean, my bench press is very inconsistent. And to be honest, my last test uh, before this cycle, where I got 353 pounds, that was a pretty big PR for a bench press. So that kind of, that, that will last me for a while, if you know what I mean, you know, that, that, that was kind of a couple of cycles worth of work, I reckon, so it's not a, you know, disaster that I didn't get that, then finally, my deadlift, I've already explained it, um, in depth, but yeah, that was obviously crap, but I have got things in place now, I think I've kind of drawn up a plan of attack in terms of my deadlift, and obviously, you'll see that as my videos unfold, but I'm going to start including a bit more speed work and some other things to make sure I, you know, nail that deadlift, because I've got a big target for the year, um, and I want to get at least near it. So we shall see. Anyway, I did all that chest stuff, which you've just seen there. And I finished with some tricep work. And I hammered those bad boys. I did um, tricep extensions on the cable uh, pull down with this attachment, which I really like. And my gym did not have one of them. Um, and I literally went the entire way up the stack. So I went from almost at the bottom of the stack. I must have done about 10 sets. I just kept dropping the weight up, uh, dropping the weight down, and then moving up and going again. I did it loads and loads of times. So the point, by the time I got to here, I was lifting the equivalent of a slow loris accessory. So you know those weird little monkeys with massive eyes, the slow lorises that are really small. Imagine uh, one of them was wearing like a jacket or a hat, like a top hat, which I'm pretty sure they do wear in the wild. Um, the weight of one of those, um, it was very light. But that said, look at that tricep engagement. Um, that's what I'm talking about. Anyway, that, my friends, is that. I just thought I would share this with you because um, I do do bodybuilding work, but you don't always see a great deal of it, and I thought I would just show you this session because it was entirely devoted to bodybuilding. Um, <clears throat> and I thought, obviously, as well, 
you might want to hear me uh, whinge on a little bit more about my uh, test week. So, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, as always, and I will see you tomorrow.